Greetings, this is this, and I am me, and I cannot handle spicy foods so much so that sometimes I'll think a barbecue sauce is too spicy. Yeah, that's right, not a spicy barbecue sauce, just a barbecue sauce. I, I was thinking of that because I just had some Lay's Mesquite Barbecue Chips. Lay's Stacks, which are a thousand times better than Pringles. And I told that to literally every person in the entire universe when they first came out. Um, and no one was having it. Everyone was like, ew, gross. No, these Pringles are way better. Pringles are disgusting, okay? Pringles are like a piece of paper. So Lay's Stacks all the way. But anyway, um... Yeah, sometimes if I get it, not like with those, but if I get, were to eat normal barbecue chips, if I have one that has like a little too much like powder on it, I would be like, <coughs> yeah, I know it's pathetic. But anyway, um, okay, last time when we left off, I was working on getting more stuff out of here, which I am pumping stuff out of here, which is good. And maybe I can like dig a little bit more of this and have the rest of that oil flow down there. Because that would be helpful. And I don't know if maybe they dig here, if this will help this kind of flow over, or if it already is flowing over. I'm not really sure. But any, uh, regardless of any of that, we're going to want to dig down some more. Even though we're getting really deep down, and it's going to take duplicates forever to get there and back, which is concerning. But whatever. Um, well, actually, I should switch out the rest of this with plastic then, shouldn't I? Because I only switched out to here because this is where they would go to get to stor storage units and stuff like that. Um, and they barely ever went all the way down here. But if we have the plastic... Okay, I should at least do a little bit more. Let's go to here at least. There. Um, and I'm really proud of my... If, you know, we could ever move again. Thank you. <laughs> I'm really proud of this up here. I know, it's just the simplest, stupidest thing, but I think it's going to be great for us. So, yeah. We've got that working, and if I could get more things working like that, that would be really cool. But I, I don't know if I'll be able to. Um, I'm seeing a lot of things that look problematic. Okay, but anyway, mostly what we're supposed to be working on today is up here, right? Everything is fine on the way up. Okay. So, yeah, what have we got? We have our doors closed off right now, even though our batteries are getting power because apparently somebody's coming up here and running on this when they don't need to be. But it's fine, whatever. This is what I was working on doing is replacing the solar panels here and getting the pipes installed. They have two more here, but they can't do it yet because they have to put this in here first, which they can get to. Yes, they can get to, okay. So that but then also um plumbing insulated ceramic Ooh, look at all the ceramic i got now except they use so much of it just for one pipe it's insane um okay they can oops they can reach all of those so that's fine good so they'll they'll um build those pieces of pipe also and then i've told them to work on making this chain of pipe all the way down this way. Good. I think we can get this set up today as long as I don't forget about it and have a big gap of time where they're not working on it at all when they could be. <laughs> I'm a little concerned about the fact that I don't have any stops on either side. You know, I don't have a well of any kind. Um, but oh well, we're just gonna let it drip down and have to mop it, I guess. The, s the smaller amount that I can leave sitting here, the better, I guess. They won't get too angry if they're in their exosuits, right? About, like, walking through water. Not water, but a liquid. I hope they don't get too angry about it. Um, so, yeah. If you guys want to work on that at any time. Are you going to work on these pipes right now? No. Okay, it's fine. It's, it it's fine. We'll get to it. Um, okay, hydrogen. Oh, I should probably turn the hydrogen generator off now, right? Not the generator, but, you know, flip the switch here. Because you guys are now officially getting everything you need. Okay, yeah, I... Goodness, let's get get rid of that. 
And that will close off everything, if I'm not mistaken. Our power will go this way and only this way. Right? This line will still look like it's getting power, but that's because it's hooked up to a different... It's hooked up to this line. Okay. Good. Did that. I want to make more of these, but we haven't even filled these ones back up yet. So, you know. Um, next dormancy, 67 days. So I have 67 days to try and fill these with as much natural gas as I can and get as many of these as I can. <sighs> okay. We'll do our best. Um, I did expand this to allow for another tree. So can I or should I get any more? Wow, they built all that ladder already. Can I or should I get any more um, generators for that? I don't know. Okay, you are slowly but surely pumping stuff out of here. Okay. That's good. Let's dig this and put a ladder piece here. Okay. Good. So, we don't have any more oil though. Yeah, we just straight up don't have any. I've been pumping out water. We have been bringing water up. It is... Ugh. Very warm. Because it's go it goes through the hot area? Like, how... No, plumbing. <laughs> how quickly does it lose its heat? Was it ever... 46 degrees? It's never really cool, was it? 39 degrees? My goodness. Okay, how badly am I warming up this area up here? Oh. Okay. I would like to pump out all the rest of that water from down here. Um, but I don't... You know, we've made- surely we've made some room in the liquid reservoir, reservoir right? So close these out. It, this water is too hot that's being brought up. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I hate it, honestly. Grab all that and, you know, cool- cool everything down by bringing that up to us. So I'm just gonna start digging then to the next oil pocket because we need more oil. So... How about we have them dig all the way down to here? So this oil will fall down here, and then we'll dig over into that pocket and have that flow down if it can. But maybe we should even try digging over to here and we should put the the pump right in here. I can put a whole rig in there. So I maybe should just do that. I maybe should just do that. Um oh okay, it's nighttime. You guys can go quickly, quickly, quickly through the night. Um, okay, zoom out, zoom out, zoom out, zoom out. Can I not zoom out any more than this? Sparkle streaking? Can I zoom out more? Yes or no? Just, oh goodness. Dog bark scared me. <laughs> um, hmm. Did they, they got the pipe? No. They didn't even get any of the pipe. Oh, okay, they're getting this pipe right now. That's good. Okay. I always mention it every single time you can't hear it, and then I don't mention it when you can hear it, but so I'm just going to mention it again anyway. If you can hear the dog barking, please ignore it. <laughs> it's fine. Um, okay, guys. Come on, just help me out. Help me out with something here, okay? Oh, yeah. Good job. Okay, they're working on it. They're working on it. At least we're protected while they're busy working on this, right? I just- I want it- I want it to all be put together and be good, you know? I don't want to wait. I don't want to be patient. Ooh! Whoa! Wait, what? <laughs> Where did all this oil come from? Should we bring it up when it's at 8 degrees? That's fine, right? It's not super chilled? But it's- it's okay. Where did it all come from, though? I had them dig down here. And for some reason that made all of this oil spill over this way so that they could... Use it? 
okay, I don't understand it, but I'm glad. Maybe we just sucked up all the water and so then the oil, oil spilled over. Maybe? I don't know. Okay, well, that's good because we needed some more oil and they are working their way down here. So, okay. Go in here too. And grab that. Um, new printable. What's it gonna be? I don't know. Bristleberries. Thank you. Okay. So, those are the things I'm working on. Those are the things. I think we need more lime for you, don't we? Lime. 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 Okay, thank you. Yeah, we don't have any lime. And I told them to crush lime at a very low priority for the rest of time. We do have a lot of eggshells. Well, not a lot, but we have enough to make some lime, so let's put this up at a three priority. Telling them to make lime and salt. Um. Wow. I don't have very much salt anymore, do I? Okay, chill it with the salt, guys. How often do you make that? Do we have a lot of table salt? Um... Where, where, where would it be? Uh, no. 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 I don't have any. I guess I just used up all my salt because I don't ever dig it. That's fine, okay, but make lime so that you can keep making steel. You're overheated down here, but I'm not concerned about it because I was waiting for this dude to help chill this area anyway. Which, I mean, at least he is green. Unlike these guys up here. They're not even green. <sighs> now the phone is ringing. My goodness, guys. It's an endless amount of interruptions. <laughs> okay. Well, wow. This is a lot of clean water. That's a really nice source of clean water. That I just don't ever do anything with. It's hot, which is not good, but... Okay, how is this area doing? It's not horribly melted or anything yet, right? Okay, we have this over here, which is dangerous that there's no exosuits. It's dangerous that there's no exosuits near that thing. Um, I haven't told them to do anything with it. But if I were to tell them, they would get hurt. I might have to build another... I might have to not do anything with this area right now. Look, it's gonna melt everything, though. When it's erupting. Crud. Okay, I have to finish digging out this area, but also I think get another exosuit station before you enter that zone. <sighs> Which is going to be more power and more oxygen. I hate that. Do I want them to just have exosuits on whenever they're out here? No, because then there's only a limited number of people that can be out here. Although, what an exo... Each exosuit station takes power, doesn't it? Yeah. And oxygen, not plumbing. Oxygen. Oxygen. Ah, uh, I don't know what to do about that. Maybe. Maybe I can close it off from here. And they can go in this way. And use these exosuits. That's a good idea, right? Because I'm getting rid of the whole area anyway. So I know, I did this whole big long thing. It was supposed to be great for them. It was supposed to be real special. Had the ladder here and everything. Um, But I think we should close this off. So deconstruct this ladder. Deconstruct this fire pole. And we'll put a door there that we will then lock. And we'll start tunneling our way through here. Um, and I'll put a door here, just so that the polluted oxygen doesn't eek over here. I know that there is polluted oxygen around, but, you know, let's, I guess, just not mix the biomes too much if I don't have to. So, um, probably we want it right at the level of the thing. We'll just make as skinny of a tunnel as possible. Going directly over that way, so that when all, everything is dug out, but this is still just chilling here, 
we can have like a little set, like there'll be floor here so they can walk over to this, grab the iron, and then leave. You know? Maybe. Maybe, I don't know. I know it's also a long trek, but honestly, it's probably not that... It's probably not that worse. Yeah, it's not as... I think this is actually a longer trek to go all the way out that way than this is. Um, can you guys, like, do... That? Like, you can get over there then, right? I think you can get over there, and we can put a manual airlock. Um, I guess right here. And then, yeah, another one over here, Bubbles. Thank you. And then another one over here. Okay. Careful, Bubbles. I know, they already could not never breathe when they came down here, so it'll be better if they have exosuits on. Much better. I find it interesting that they're starting this direction, because I was assuming they were going to start the other direction. It's not going to be cheap, but I would like to do plastic tiles all the way through so that they have better run speed to make the trip quicker. Um, but we're probably going to have to wait a little while, I guess, for them to be able to do that. Okay, so we have a door here. They're still working on it right now, so I'll leave the door open. But this is dangerous to walk past here. Marie! My god, everyone is so concerned by this little- if you- okay. If you guys were walking through someplace, and you walked through this little puddle of water, would you stop on this burning hot volcano and, uh, metal in order to be like, huh, oh, I, I stepped in a puddle. No, you wouldn't. Only a crazy person would do that. Cray. Z. Okay, so lock this now. Because nobody's down there. So lock that one, and we'll work our way over this way. Okay, good. I'm like, please don't let somebody lock it from the wrong direction. <laughs> um, okay, okay, good. Is that, so that was all the oil that we could get out of there? I guess that was all the oil we could get out of there. Unless, of course, doing this would help me at all. I'll try it. And then... Uh, I guess just dig to here. I'm really afraid that this is going to make everything explode, though. It's a big, 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 big pocket. It scares me. Dig these edges. See if we can get oil to fall down that way. Oh, but then it's going to fall all the way down here. That's fine. <laughs> I guess. I don't know. I don't know yet, guys. You have some oil, so we can make some more plastic. That's fine. Okay. Back up. It's nice, but also kind of scary to not have to check in on my base all the time. Um, so I disabled the auto repair on all of these batteries, except for this first one. Um, so they wouldn't keep wasting steel on them while they continue to keep breaking until we get all of this set up, which I guess I'm still very confused as to why they haven't done yet. But whatever. Could I go? Oh, please, could I? Could I go? Thank you. Okay, but they got all of that piping done. I just, I don't want to give them more piping to do if they haven't even done this piping yet, but whatever. It's just that they haven't done the solar panel yet. They're doing it right now. Thank you, Camille. <laughs> Thank you so much. Okay, good. There, now they'll be able to walk on top of the solar panel and get the rest of those pipes. Okay, so now I can queue up the rest of these without thinking I'm being an idiot. Am I still making them be insulated? I think so, yeah. Insulated, but not with ceramic. With... Um, I think I had it as granite. Okay. Yeah. Let's go with granite. Um, continue to go down here. And then over this way. Fine, make it wibbly wobbly. I don't care. Um, no. Don't make it wibbly wobbly that way. That would be a bad idea. Okay. And then we're near water. Which way do I need to go, though? I need to let some of the petroleum... 
through. Petroleum goes through this orange pipe. Goes through the orange pipe. Okay, so I think if I just go like right here. Insulated pipe going up. I'm trying to find where I can cross over here, because if I have the pipe coming down this way. Can't go over there, because that's two liquid bridges. So, I could make it go over here somehow? Probably. Um, I didn't actually want to go this far over, but fine, whatever. Insulated, insulated... Okay, is that good? Liquid bridge... Um, input, output, input, output, um, oh, there, and then we can do that. Input, output, and you're gonna go over, and then you're gonna go, uh, oh, dude, why is this so difficult? <laughs> we need to dig out another piece right here. And then go over. So that we can then connect up. But here... No, you need actual space for the valve. Crud, so all those pipes that they just... Did a fantastic job of placing so quickly, I might have to get rid of. Like these, I might have to get rid of. So I have to delete these ladders. And put the valve up here. I'd like to have it closer to my base, but there's no... There's no wall space, I don't think. Can I... I can't put it there because the bridge is in the way, right? Um, hello? Hello? Hello, could I... Hi, please? Please could... Thank you. Liquid valve? Yeah, it doesn't... They don't let you. I have to put the liquid valve here. And then the liquid bridge... Here. So it goes in... Out, excuse you. It goes in, out, in, out, in, out, in, out. Connect up. Okay. Good. Um, okay. Bad. Well then, there. That's gonna be all set up, but I actually kept it all insulated pipes, so isn't it gonna be kind of warm as it gets up there? Well, we'll see what it does. We'll just see. Um, pipsqueak? I don't need another pipsqueak. Uh, iron gut? I don't care about divers lungs is nice, but um, I don't know if I need you, Max. Uh, hmm. I will just get the pipsqueak for now. I guess. Um, I don't know. For the millionth time, I do want to get another person. I'm just not ready. It's not ready yet. Okay. So, you guys didn't get the pipes yet. But that's fine. You didn't get the wire yet? Okay, yeah, they didn't get that one piece of wire yet. That's also fine, I suppose. Is this wire? Why am I telling them to make wire up there? Is this a piece of wire? No, it's a piece of pipe, right? Okay, it's a piece of pipe. And that's a piece of pipe, too. Okay. And then never mind. We're fine. Um, are you guys ever going to, I don't know, there's no point in asking them anymore. They do what they want, I suppose. They do what they want. They do have limited resources, you know? So, I guess I shouldn't be too harsh. Um, okay, what else? Did, you guys probably finished this pathway. Good, okay, so I probably don't have enough plastic to really go any further. Not really. Um, I guess what I can make with plastic, I will. 
Let's not use all of it. Let's leave a little bit. And then the rest is just gonna have to be ladder for now. Switch it out to be plastic later. Okay, guys, so this way you'll be able to get to another iron volcano, which is a lot more iron, and all of this cold stuff that we are going to keep digging out. And a whole bunch of wee swords. Um, okay, building broken, uh-huh. Overheated, building entombment, yada, yada, yada. That's all just... That stuff is just stuff I don't even care about, honestly. Like, who's worried? I'm not. Um... I wish we had more room for more... Lumber, because it feels like... It feels like... It looks like... We've got a lot... Of lumber. And, like, maybe I could make another... Oh. Never mind, apparently we don't have very much lumber. I seriously don't have very much lumber, really? It's a... What would it be? Manufactured material? They cut it up! Oh, it's an industrial ingredient, of course, of course, of course. I have 41,000! You just mean insufficient because it didn't... They didn't resupply it? Okay, well, that's fine. It's fine that they didn't resupply it. Um, I want to make that place bigger. And use it for more things. Use it, use it as its own power source, not an emergency power source. It's a bad idea, though. I need to have emergency power sources for when the natural gas gets gone. But, like, we already have a power transformer down here. I could ho hook a whole new line of power off of it. Instead of just using it to help the other power line, you know? It can be bigger. I don't know. I guess I don't know what I should do with that just yet. <laughs> Fine. Okay. Did you guys work on this yet? It went in here. It went, it went out here. Oh, I don't think I put enough pipe connecting these things. There we go. And and like that. Okay. Okay, this will bring this will bring petroleum all the way up here. I set it to 10 kilograms. Which it's going to drop here and then just fall because well, no, it won't. It's blocked off, I think. But I do need them to deconstruct this now. So they can deconstruct all those tiles so that they can build it in its correct spot. Thank you very much, Camille. She got a little worn out. Just You gotta give her a second. She's taking a breather. There you go. And there go the tiles. Don't get yourself stuck, Camille. Don't get yourself stuck. Oh, perfect. Good job, Camille. You took one for the team. Okay. Power. Solar panel. Tons of glass. Hook it up. And heavy wire conductive wire. Made out of steel. Put it right there. Perfect. Okay, guys. You just wait. You just wait. Um. Ooh! It's working! It's working, but it's- No! There's so- Why is- where did you even get all this petroleum from? It just looks small because it's just... It's 10 kilogram drops. Oh wow, it's actually really cool. Like, temperature-wise. <laughs> okay, okay, but somebody has to close this then. It shouldn't be a valve. It shouldn't be a valve. I didn't know there was going to be that much that quickly. At a nighttime time. Somebody turn it off. Somebody close it. It should be a sensor thing. I don't know how. I don't know what. We'll, how we'll make it sense that it... Needs to turn off, but I don't know. I think it needs to turn off. I think that's way more than I wanted to get rid of. I think I made a mistake. At least all the drywall is there, though. Ooh, look! You can actually start to see it now. Um, petroleum is 41 degrees. Solar panel is 41 degrees, too. Okay. Oh, look, it's down here. Let me see. Um, it's... Oh, my God. Wow, look how fast the temperature's dropping on the petroleum. That's incredible. Oh, it's slowing down. <laughs> That's fine. 
You guys are 117, one, ooh, cooling rapidly. You're still very hot. Guys, is this gonna work? Oh my god. Okay, even if they've closed the valve already? Okay, yeah, we still had more to drop down. Well, that could be... I like that some dropped down here before we had this solar panel made, so that um, even though this wasn't hooked up yet, we still got some down here. I don't know. That that could be a solution, guys. So you can enable auto repair. You can enable auto repair. Both of you guys, I think, will be okay. You guys are not touching the petroleum, so therefore are not really cooling. You're actually getting hotter. Okay. Then that gives me a lot of confidence that the petroleum is doing exactly what it needed to do. Okay, and the temperature is still dropping. Oh my god. <laughs> Guys, that's amazing. Okay, so... Um... I don't know. We might be ready to turn this back on, then. Should, should, should I turn it back on? No. Don't turn any- don't, like, don't open the doors yet because this power wire isn't connected. This- this power wire. I know you can't tell, but it's not. Right there. So... I'm still going to wait. But I think once I open it back up, it will be a lot better. Because we now have the emergency- emergency switch. And I have a cooling method. And I have six batteries. And I have a manual generator. So... I think I can get rid of this. Um... Okay. There. I think I- I think I did that? I don't want to be wrong. I don't want to speak too soon. I don't want to be crazy. But I kind of think I did it. Drywall. I don't know what I'm making this out of, but just put it back here too, I guess. We should have it behind everybody. Okay. There. That's good. Um, no, don't go to sleep. Every time I come down here, you guys go to sleep again. How are we doing on these? They are filling up. It's slow, but they're filling up. I think we'll be able to fill a couple more before time is up. Before the 67 days is up. Are up. Whatever. <laughs> um, actually, I don't have 67 days. I have, like, just a couple days, right? Because one is not good enough. I need both of them running. If we don't have both of them running, we pull from our reserves. And your next dormis dormancy is in four days. So... We're gonna- all of this is gonna be depleted again in four days from now. Oh dear. Okay. Well, I tried. I tried. Did we figure out what you are? There's polluted water right there, but that doesn't actually mean literally anything at all. Um... Bring the ladder down here and here. See if I can see what that one is. Um. Okay. We have some polluted water down here. And other stuff down here. Should I go sideways and then down? We can't go through the diamond, so I guess I have to, right? Let's go sideways. And then down. Ladder here? What is this? Oh, obsidian? I can dig through that, right? Hopefully? I, I hope so. And then ladder, I can't go any further. So that's actually not very helpful. Be careful! Guys! That must be so scary. That must be terrifying. Can you even imagine? Being in oil like that? Oh my god. Okay, well anyway. The printables are available. What do I have? Um, shine nymph eggs. Okay, cool. They're just gonna chill there until they probably hatch. And then, I don't know. Um, building broken. Damage overheated. How's everybody doing? Are we still making... We don't have enough lime. Do you want me to tell them to make more lime? Do you want me to tell them to make lime faster? Let's tell them to make lime a little bit faster. How is this doing? 
34. That technically is cooler. <sighs> There's no, it's not cooling fast enough though. Because it sits here for so long, it warms up, right? Like I'm waiting to see if I can let it be cool and then turn this back on. Um, when we've actually gained some coolness, but I don't think we're going to gain any coolness. Look how many hatches there are in here now. Let's see, it's soaring six out of 20. Are you guys, no, you're cramped already? Are you kidding me? But I made it as big as it can possibly be. Okay, fine. Six is the max then. One, two, three, one, 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 two, three, four, five, six. Is it because there's eggs in there too? That's okay. I do have auto wrangle surplus on, surplus on, but I don't know where they would bring them. There's no other place. But well, and they are just gonna keep hatching because the eggs are just sitting here. So there's no way for me to stop this getting even more overcrowded. But <sighs> oh well, I'm sorry. You guys are just gonna have to be unhappy. I don't know. It's ridiculous that that's a, how many you can hold, even though a critter drop-off thing lets you drop off 20. But the maximum size of a room that you can make like that can barely hold any. Whatever. Um, I still never rerouted this water, did I? It's all just been pooling at the bottom. Pooling down here, probably. It's okay. We're at least not... I didn't want that one. I wanted this one. We're at least not overheating, which means the Wheeze Ward is doing a good job. Okay. Okay. Ceramic pipes are completely set up now, so I'm going to let them dump out a little bit more petroleum. It's the middle of the day, so if I tell them to, to turn this on... No! Turn it on to just... Just 10 like I had before. Fine, 37. I don't care. <laughs> turn this on... And, or open it up, whatever. Just let a little bit get through, and then close it. I don't know how much will be a good amount. Uh, close it. Somebody close it. Somebody close it. <laughs> Somebody close it before dinner time! I don't want them to go to dinner. Close it. Is it closed? Maybe it is closed. Oh yeah, they closed it. Okay. <laughs> Good. Now please tell me you split that between the two places. Did any of it even get up here yet? Where is it all? It's on its way. <laughs> it is on its way. It is going on a trip in its favorite rocket ship, soaring through the sky, little Einsteins. Because this is working a treat. I just needed to touch more things. Let's see, you guys both just want- you do have soggy feet still, are you kidding me? But- <laughs> You're in a suit, why would you care? Whatever. Also, I had a metal tile over here, not a bunker tile, so I'm replacing that and then I'm putting another bunker tile right there. Um... Good, okay. That was all we got? Yeah, okay, I think I need to let them dump a little bit more out. <laughs> because it didn't even pool up here. There was such a small amount. Like, apparently there's some here, but I can't even see it. So, okay, fine. We'll let them drop out more tomorrow. In the morning. And then... <sighs> Do I turn the telescope back on? The telescope still doesn't have cooling things, cooling stuff dropping over onto it. But it's not hot. It only gets hot if it gets hit. And hopefully, if none of the rest of our system breaks from overheating, then this won't get hit because the doors will close properly. And or we use my emergency switch. You know what I'm saying? Hey, switch. So... Nope. Okay, but everything is connected. Good, 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 good. Okay. Then, yeah. Is it morning? It is morning. It is morning. It is morning. It is morning. Here, guys, take a little bit more, okay? That much. And let it go through. I just, how do we get that much that quickly? That's what I'm confused about. Like, where does it come from? There's some right there. Is it just this one blob? <laughs> this one blob is five kilograms. 
So does, does it just eke this one blob all the way through? But like, in little chunks? The whole blob went that way, and, and then there it goes. <laughs> oh, it looks like I was already sending some up there. Okay. Well then, since these are much bigger blobs, these are ten times bigger blobs than I did the first time, we should definitely be closing this valve. Close- close the valve. Close the valve. Ruby? Ren? Somebody? Somebody close the valve. Did you close it? Okay. Somebody closed it. Let me double check. Okay, good. And... Let's see. Pool, 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 pool. Uh, I'm not seeing any pooling happening yet. Come on, guys. Pool, pool, pool. It's pooling. It's pooling longer on the bottom. Pooling longer on the bottom. Top still. I'm not seeing any pooling happening. Is it just because you can't see it on the solar panels, or is it falling below? Please don't tell me it's falling below and I moved the solar panels for nothing because they should have had tile underneath them. No, everything else falls on top of them, so this should fall on top of them too. Well, that was everything. It says that there's petroleum up here, I just can't see it. So, I'm just gonna assume that it's helping us. And so you have auto repair on, you have auto repair on, you have auto repair on, you can have auto repair on because you get cooled, and you can have auto repair on because you're getting cooled. You, my friend, are not touching the petroleum. So you can't. Okay, so they're all going to work. Oh, but I still need this to be able to touch the, the petroleum as well. Okay, so I need to drop more petroleum down here. So it has to reach all the way out to this before I can, before I can, um you know, open the doors and let everything run. Okay, well, fine then. But we're going to have to wait for that to happen next time because I'm actually out of time for today. Even though I know, I know it was a little bit shorter. I'm sorry, but you just add up all the times it was way longer. <laughs> and then it all evens out. Um, okay, we have some worrisome things, like this is about to be dormant. But we also have some good things, like the space stuff upstairs is going to work next episode. I'm sure of it. So I probably just jinxed myself. Uh, but anyway, we'll work on that next time and probably more of uh, digging out more of that before it all melts and getting down to this oil. Oh yeah, is it exploding? Okay, good. It's not, even though it is open down here. Okay. Well, yes, we can get a new endless oil supply next episode also by setting up an oil rig i've never done that yet before so that's going to be exciting that is all for today thank you guys so much for watching see you all in the next episode bye bye now i know i still didn't hook this up i'm sorry bye bye now <laughs>